Hi, this is Adam from IDES Canada and today I want to make a real quick video just to show you how to fill up your SM100 using a scuba tank. You can use the SM100's little tank and fill it up at a scuba shop directly but uh, it's a lot more convenient if you have a scuba tank with you to be able to fill it up. So the first step is I make sure that the valve is closed and there is no pressure on the gauge. Then just unscrew the tank. If your tank has the little protector here on the fill nipple, take it off. Connect it to our adapter. So this is a standard scuba tank with a K valve and it has here our fill station. So I'm just gonna atta attach it like that. I'll show you again. You just pull back on the ring and push the nipple in. Okay, now we just turn on the air and you wait. When you hear that the air is going in, uh, when it stops, that's when it's full. We close the valve and vent the air that's trapped between the two tanks. That simple. So if you live in North America, you probably have access to a K-valve scuba station, which uses this type of fill station from us. If you live in Europe and the rest of the world, you probably use a DIN station. Difference is, on a K-valve, the fill station goes on top, and on a DIN, it goes inside. So I'm just gonna show you how to fill up the DIN as well. So you screw in the fill station, just hand tight is enough. You then connect the tank to the scuba, station, uh, scuba fill station, and you just open the valve and let the air go through. When you finish, you close the valve. I'm sure if you can see the valve here. You close it up. You push this button in the middle, which vents the air out. And take out your tank. It's that simple. Thank you for watching. Please check us out on YouTube and LinkedIn.